Welcome back. I am so excited to be here with Ted Thomas, the king of tax lien certificates and deeds. He is actually teaching me something better than wholesaling, which got me out of my parents' basement and turned me into the multimillionaire that I am today. So I'm super excited and we are going to get right into it. So Ted, after watching and listening to these videos, let's just start off actually explain to everyone again what tax lien certificates are and tax lien deeds. Okay, good. I'll be uh, brief with that, folks, because it was on the first three videos. If you want to watch those again, but a tax lien certificate is issued in half of the states when someone doesn't pay the property tax. So if you own a $200,000 house, you don't pay your tax. as a 1% tax due on the property. If you don't pay it, they're going to issue a tax lien certificate, which is nothing more than a piece of paper. Then if it isn't paid, they're going to make an announcement and they have hundreds of thousands of these. Matter of fact, I'm going to just reach over here and I'm going to get a a, a, a newspaper from Tampa, Florida, just to demonstrate that. All right, so you can see this is Tampa Bay Times. All right, now this newspaper is issued all of the month of May in the state of Florida. And it's and all of the tax liens in that particular county are gonna be listed. So I'm just gonna flip, I'm not doing page to page, I'm doing re real sections of pages. All right, so what's gonna happen with this newspaper is there's 40,000 certificates in this newspaper. 40,000, wow. you can buy any one of those. A few minutes ago, I showed people Miami and you might've missed that. So let me back up and I'll show you Miami again. This is the Miami Times. There's over 60,000 certificates available. So every county in Florida will sell those in the month of May. Guess what? Those certificates never sell out. There's always too many. There's over a million certificates available just in the state of Florida. So you can buy that certificate. It's the safest, the most lucrative investment in America today. Why? You're not investing with Ted, you're investing directly <laughs> with the government and you'll get your check back from the government. 97% of all the certificates will pay you 100% of what you invested plus the high interest rate. Interest rates are 18 all the way to 36%. How about that? This is amazing. This is absolutely amazing. Okay, so Ted, after watching and listening to these videos, I have a few questions from my viewers. Sure. Uh, the first one <laughs> is a big one. Is it possible to get started with only a few thousand dollars well, absolutely, sure. I mean, everybody's going to start with a few thousand dollars because they're going to be timid. They don't. They're they're nervous. Yeah. So you can buy tax certificates for less than a thousand dollars. Now, just so you know, taxes generally are one percent on uh, in most states. Now, some states like New York and New Jersey, uh, they'll have a little higher percentage. But the point is, one percent tax on a two hundred thousand dollars is only two thousand dollars. So you could buy on a two hundred thousand dollar house. You, you understand for two or three thousand dollars, you could be getting in for very low money and mm -hmm. you're going to make yeah. high interest rate. And if you don't get yeah. paid, you get the property without a mortgage. Yes. Oh, my gosh. OK, Ted, I really understand these tax lien certificates and it really seems like anyone can do it. Is there any complications that I need to know about? Well, sure. There's going to be lots of little complications because the local counties make their own rules. They're going to say, well, you have to show up. You have to pay it this way. They want, no, you can't walk in with a credit card. You have to walk in with a, uh, a cashier's check or a bank yeah. check, or they might want you to put a, a deposit up ahead of time. So there'll be lots of little rules. Those are always listed in, in the, I'm just reaching for one. Uh, like this is an auction brochure and uh, you couldn't see it very well because we're on green screen, but in the auction brochure is going to tell you, tell you exactly what you have to do. So there's gonna be rules for every auction and we can do all of that online. Cause once I get you accessing online, we can we can we can see every county and every county property and we can know all the rules. I love it. I love it. Okay. Ted, as you know, I am an investor and I think most of my clients want to be an investor. So they aren't going to want to do small deals, you know, right. if they're not. Is it possible that they can make twenty five or fifty thousand dollars and can okay, they do let this me online? Show you, <laughs> I'm glad I'm glad you're asking that question. Let me tell you why. I don't teach people to make five or 10,000 bucks. I mean, that's not the business. I'm a professional yeah. investor, a professional teacher and educator. And so here's what you guys want to do. You want to buy properties with discounts of 70, 80, 90%. I, I know that. I know that's what you want. So we're going to teach you to buy the property. These properties will start with 10, 20, 30 cents is where they'll start. So you want to buy a property that's got margin. All right, now every property isn't 100,000. So let's say you bought one for 20 cents on the dollar and it was worth 100. I don't even hold out to try to get the hundred. I'm going to buy it low, say 20 cents on the dollar. I'm going to sell it for 50 cents on the dollar. I'm going to make 30%. I'm going to buy it low. I'm going to <laughs> yeah. sell it low and I'm going to do it fast. All yeah. right. So I'm going to show you 
how to do that online. So let me put a, a woman on here that I taught. She does not live in the United States. She lives in British Columbia. Now, if you don't know, that's a, one of the Canadian provinces all the way over in the West, above Seattle, Washington, is this huge province. It stretches from the American border, the US border, all the way to the Arctic Circle. It's that big, it's bigger than Texas. All right, she lives there. She said, look, I got plenty of money, but I can't make any money in the stock market because it's going up and down, up and down. And she yeah. said, I'm trying all these things. I tried investment advisors. I tried financial planners. Can you really make money at this? I said, why don't I teach you how to do it online? You can sit there at your kitchen table. You're going to hear her right now from her kitchen table. Her name is Deborah. You'll absolutely love this. My name is Deb Murphy, and I'm here in Kelowna, British Columbia. I had purchased my first property. I bought it for twenty-four thousand. It'll literally sell for it'll sell for seventy thousand. I'll probably list it around seventy-five, seventy-six, and it'll it'll sell. I did it all online by phone and by. Um, computer. Ted's material showed me that I can depend on uh, the county records, what's online as far as property appraisers records, what's online as far as all the documentation uh, around a property that I could depend on knowing 75 percent of what's going on with that property without even stepping foot on it. So there's just so much more available online, and that's why we can do it successfully now from Canada. Ted really fills out the full picture. He wants you to be successful. Okay, now there you have it. She didn't buy just over the border. She's right. in British Columbia, all right? That's north of Seattle. All right, get this. She bought in Florida within 60 miles of where I'm sitting right now. She bought in Florida, and she invested 25000 She not only made the twenty five back, but she made another 50 on her first wow. deal. Now, That's she awesome. didn't sell. Everybody else, I tell people, buy it low, sell it low, and sell. She said, I don't want to yeah. sell it. I said, well, you want to hold it? Now, a lot of women invest differently than men. Why do they do that? Because mm -hmm. security is number one with the ladies. That's right. All right, so security is important. She said, I just want to have that income. Right. She's going to have a 40% return every year on that property. 40%, folks. Where are you going to get stuff like that? So you get the idea. So anybody can do that. So every woman, okay. I can tell you right now, 64% of all my clients are women. 64%. Why? Because I teach them, keep your good looking clothes on. Go ahead and do your fingernails. Do your hair. We're going to teach you to use the computer. You're not going to fix any property up. If it needs work, you call the guy. He shows up with it. You don't need a pickup truck. You don't need any tools. Mm -mm. That's what we teach. Buy them quickly sell them now there's some you're going to have to some of these are used and abused so they're going to have to have some fix up so you're going bit, to think yeah. that up but you know that before you buy so you see my whole system is know your exit strategy before you buy well if i've got an auction brochure and a property's worth a hundred thousand and i can yeah. buy for twenty thousand i already know my exit strategy is not a hundred i'm going to sell it for 50 or 60 if i can get it right let those wholesale guys do all that work they got a right. pickup truck they got greasy hands. They got paint in their hair. I don't have any of that. Look at that. You like my shirt? Pretty good, right? Not quite as good as Noel, but not bad. Not bad. <laughs> you are too so funny. You okay. I do. And this, this is good. This is so good because it, it is really my opening. But, but, but let's talk about it. We know this because I have to go there. Ted, the investment business is really filled with hype. Okay. Hype. I have clients that are grandmothers and grandfathers, working people. And they would love to make $50,000 in one year. Is that realistic? It's definitely realistic. Okay. Now, my clients, as I already told you, 64% are women. So I'm going to let you decide for yourself. I'm going to show you a video of Grandma Shannon. Now, Grandma <laughs> Shannon, her kids are in their late 20s at this point. She's a school teacher. She makes about 50 grand a year. And mm -hmm. we taught her how to do it. And I'm going to let her express herself to you for the next couple of minutes. And then we'll come back and I'll talk about other people making 25 and 50,000. I'm not going to teach anybody to make 10,000. People make a $10,000 mistake in real estate and they go bankrupt. You're not going to have that problem because we're going to teach you that you need to know what your exit strategy is before you buy. You don't buy and then go pray that you're going to sell it. The hell with that stuff. This is a business that you can look at the property evaluate it ahead of time 
and then mm -hmm. buy it right. You do not make money. I don't care what any real estate person says. You do not make any money selling. Everybody right, says buy it low buy. and sell it high. I don't say that. I say buy it low, sell it low, make a profit. Buy it low, sell it low, make a profit. Let's watch Grandma Shannon. I'm Shannon Ulrich. Here we go today. We hadn't heard of Ted Thomas. With selling my first tax deed, I made two times my yearly salary in that six-month period. We paid around $34,000, which was 27% of the assessed value, 120. And then six months later, we were able to sell it for $135,000, which was 3.7 times our investment. So taking action can be, can be frightening when you're stuck in a rut. I mean, unless you want to be a drone all your life. I have a friend that refers to people as, that go to work 9 to 5 as drones. Yeah. One year after meeting Ted Thomas, I am a happier, wealthier person that I, I feel my alive and um, I feel my potential more than I did a year ago. This program has given me two more years of my life where I didn't have to be going to an office. So it was no biggie to quit my job. Now I get to be a grandma, and every day is a Saturday. All right, now you heard her say that. She made $100,000. That was double her school teacher's salary, and that was all done at her first auction. And so she traveled over to Seattle to do that. She did everything online, but Seattle was a live auction. So she had to go over and she bid in the room. The point is, she made $100,000. This is not unusual in this business. Now, I'm not going to sit here and give you a lot of hype that you're going to make $100,000. Let's just make it, let's get twenty five dollars on the first one. If you do better on the second, or the couple I mentioned from Michigan earlier in the earlier video, they've done four deals since last Thanksgiving. They're wow. making twenty five, thirty thousand, twenty five, thirty thousand. dollars $30,000. They are so happy. They're traveling around. They're having a good time. They're buying these properties that other people didn't want that went to tax auction. Are they mm. getting beautiful Southern mansions with big curved driveways and all that? Forget about that. The rich investors are buying all that stuff. Forget it. Right. Just buy bread and butter property and you'll make money day in and day out. This business has been around for 200 years. I personally have been doing it for 30 years. Yeah. Wow. I love okay. Ted, show me the best deal you've ever seen. Oh, listen, some of these guys make such deals. It's absolutely staggering. Bob Schumacher, okay. you're not going to believe this guy. He's uh, He graduated college in Missouri 30 years ago. He's 70 years old now. Okay. Mm -hmm. He has done 140 deals since he learned from me. All right. Now, unusual stuff. Now, I'm going to take you into the world of the weird. The world of the weird is this business because why do people walk away from property? I don't know. So in Georgia, a couple had a big fancy party at the house and in the swimming pool, someone drowned. Then the next day, they abandoned the property. Nobody knows where they are. They have abandoned it. It stayed abandoned for two years until it came up for tax auction. Their boat was still there. Their car was still in the garage. They've disappeared, but it came for auction. So he bought the property at auction. All the neighbors came and looked, but nobody bid. Because they were kind of, what happened? Yeah. What happened to this house? Yeah. Nobody knows. Yeah. He spent $2,900 for a livable <laughs> house. Three bedroom, one bath. Yeah. He did some tidy up and fix it up. He sold it. I believe it. I believe it. over I believe it. As you get into the business, I, I, and literally people have given me properties for free now that I'm a multimillionaire. When I was in my parents' basement and I needed somewhere to stay, no one offered me any properties. But once you actually get into the business, it, it, it is amazing how you can get real estate, how you position yourself for these deals. It, it, it really is. I, I, would, I, right. I can believe that. I do know yeah. stories like that. So wow. Yeah, it, was right. all, it, was all, it was all ethical, honorable. Yeah, and legal. He right. paid the tax yes. collector. Everybody yeah. clapped when he did it. He went yeah. and tidied it up and fixed it yeah. up. Well, and the beauty of it was the people that came and bought it from him, they said, gee, could you finance us? So then he became the banker. So I even have a More class money. I teach people how to be the banker. So he's the banker. And now yeah. for the next 10 years, so he made the one deal. And guess yeah. what? In one deal, but he gets paid for 10 years. Yeah. What's wrong with that? What's so that's that? what the that's business is. It's a beautiful well. business. Been, been around for all, all those decades. Now we're yeah. going to run out of time. So um, I better make sure that we, we tell you guys. Now, folks, below me, there's a registration. 
We'd love to have you come. By the way, there's just a link there, but register and then the link, the, the link will take you to the registration form. And then sure enough, if you register, I'd like to have you at the event. Now there's a $97 charge, but Noel's people get it for half price. So it's 47. So you're gonna, but you're gonna be with me all day. You're gonna start at 11 o'clock in the morning, Eastern time. So you Californians have to be up at eight o'clock if you're watching, okay? All right, so 11 o'clock and we won't stop. We're gonna go all the way to six. Now you can eat lunch and we'll have breaks and you can have a, you know, drink your tea, whatever you like to do. But you, we're gonna not only entertain you, we are gonna educate you for six solid hours. I do this every month. I've been doing it for a year and a half. I'm gonna tell you right now, people love this class. I'd have to say that the best uh, dollar for dollar deal I've ever done on a piece of land, it happened in Oklahoma. I went out to an outlying county and I bought a tax lien. The tax lien was on a 25 acre piece of land. The tax lien was only $67.12. Uh, you'd think that nobody would ever abandon a piece of land for that small of a tax bill, but things like that do happen. And guess what? Those people never did pay that tax. They never redeemed that tax lien and I ended up getting the tax deed to that property. I eventually sold that piece of land for $22,500. It's not uncommon to make ten dollars or $20,000 off of a deal.